Welcome to Vertical Q, your guide to efficient warehousing. Today's session is about goods issue against a cost center using SAP MIGO. For example, the material can be expensed from a storage location directly to a cost center or a work order number where the receiving cost center or work order does not keep the material as stock. Here is the instruction. Enter MIGO in the command field and press enter. Working from your left to right across the top of the screen. 1. Click the drop-down list as you see on your SAP. And select Goods Issue. 2. Click the second field and select Other from the drop-down list. 3. Enter the applicable movement type in the third field. Enter 201 to expense material to a cost center. Or, enter 261 to expense material to a work order. In the General tab header, 1. Type in the material request reference number. 2. Type the section or department which is receiving the materials. These fields can be standardized. Ask your supervisor or department management as to what information will be placed here. In the general tab again, fill in all the details that follow. Preferably in the order that they are presented on your screen. A. Material code. B. Quantity. C. Storage location, 1000. D. Cost center number. E. Text or information that is related to your transaction. F. Recipient, use the ID number of the requester. G. Reason, user type in, number 2. You can also enter the same details in the material field below as you wish. If you are expensing materials for a cost center, make sure that you have the item code determined before even starting this process. Here, you need to press enter so that the system populates information associated with your entries. 1. Click Check. SAP will check for missing information and errors and displays the results at the bottom of the screen. Once you have entered any missing information and or corrected any errors, click Check again. If the document is OK, move to number 3. Click Post. The message a material document is posted displays at the bottom of the screen, which includes a document number. Attach the all reference documents through the icon shown on your screen. Search from your computer folders and choose the documents to attach. Once attaching documents is done, click Save. Click Allow, and click Allow one more time. Processing a goods issue for a cost center or internal order is complete. Now, if you need to print the goods issue document, copy or write down the material document number generated after successful processing. Here is the instruction for printing. Execute MIGO forms. 1. Type in or paste the material document number in the first field. 2. Type the current year. 3. Click Execute. Click Print. 1. Choose your printer. 2. Click OK. You have successfully processed a goods issue against a cost center. Congratulations! Thank you friends. If you wish to see more videos about SAP processes like goods movement, please like this video. Subscribe to this channel. And hit the bell button. Your support really motivates us to create more explainer videos on warehousing and workplace English. Thank you.